Jimmy Buffett has made a profession out of praising the straightforward pleasures that life has to offer. Therefore, it did not come as a shock to the artist's family when the singer had a joyful spirit even in his final days, despite the fact that his cancer had taken a turn for the worst. In this week's issue of Peeable, Buffett's sister, Lori Buffett McWain, and her husband, author Tom McWain, share their thoughts on bidding goodbye to the iconic artist who passed away on September 1st at the age of 76. Buffett's death was announced on September 1st. Both Lori, age 74, and Tom, age 83, were fortunate enough to spend time with Buffett in recent months. They both agreed that, in spite of his illness, Buffett maintained his childlike spirit. He was always high-spirited, fun-loving, hard-working and creative says Tom, a friend of Buffett's who has known him for more than 50 years. It is quite surprising that we are able to report that he did not change in any way during the final month of his life. His capacity for comedy was unimpaired in any way. I pray that God would bless him for preserving his purity. Meanwhile, Lori claims that she and their sister Lucy were by their brother's side when he passed away, and that the three of them had spent some time reflecting on their time spent growing up in Alabama, much to the joy of their sibling. During Jimmy's final days, she tells me, we reminisced about our youth and the times we spent together when we would tell the same stories over and over. Jimmy would chuckle and nod his head to indicate that he had heard them before. I cannot recall ever seeing Jimmy in a melancholy state, not even in the very last part. We all enjoy joking about and laughing, but Jimmy was very good at it. Buffett, who according to Lori, was distraught when he had to postpone events due to sickness, was known for routinely bringing a smile to the faces of everyone who knew him. He brought happiness to a great many people. I am going through a lot of feelings right now, she admits. As long as Jimmy was around, I never had to worry about anything. Despite the fact that I have Tom, it will be a very different experience for me to be without my brother. Jimmy Buffett and Tom will have roles in the recently released movie All That Is Sacred, which is set in Key West in the early 1970s and had its world debut at the Telluride Film Festival in Colorado this past weekend. Tom went, and Buffett was expected to accompany Tom. Buffett did not go. Instead, Tom was by himself but not before writing a letter to his lifelong friend moments before the latter passed away. I told him that what you did in your career has a long future, but you may not be there for the applause, he recalls, adding that a funeral service for the celebrity will most likely take place within the next month. When Lori thinks back to her childhood, one of the things that stands out most is the caring nature of her older brother, Buffett. For example, when Lori fractured her leg when she was in eighth grade, Buffett made a special trip to the supermarket to purchase chocolate milk for her so that she would have some when she returned home from the hospital. She lauds his determination with regard to his professional objectives as well. She recalls, Jimmy had a dream from the beginning, and he chased it until the very end. He did a lot of things in between, but when he got to Key West, he was very unknown. However, he never gave up, and eventually audiences began gathering to listen to him perform. He was an absolutely great human being. Following Buffett's passing, Lori posted an old photo from her childhood to Instagram with the caption, Lulu, her sister Lucy, and I were just with Bubba. We shared stories from our childhoods that only siblings can truly understand and connect to. I've known him longer than anyone else on the face of the earth. I told him. He flashed his sparkling blue eyes and grinned before gently squeezing my hand. Buffett's wife Jane, their daughters Savannah and Delaney, and their son Cameron made the announcement of his passing in a statement that was posted to social media, along with a picture of Buffett sitting on a boat. The statement was accompanied with an image of Buffett. Jimmy passed away peacefully on the night of September 1st, surrounded by his family, friends, music, and dogs, read the statement. He lived his life like a song right up until the very last breath, and he will be missed beyond all measure by so many people. 